Alright, it's Steve, welcome back to Real Being Gaming. I am back on Fallout 3, we're here in Minefield. I've just done that mission for Moira where you've got to get to the playground and everything started exploding. And I was getting shot at by someone up there, so I'm going to go and investigate and find out who this douche is. Better just hope I've got some bullets though. Yeah. Are you still shooting? Oh, no need lad. Let's find out who this is and what his deal is. Thing is, I don't want to rush in there because you see these little mines. Oh! oh. It still gets me. It really makes me, like, panic when that beeping goes off. And for, our, for all I know, for our, I can't speak, for all I know, there's even more mines up here. Arkansas, who are you? What? I've, I don't even know who you are. I think out of the two of us, he's going to win with that big ass sniper rifle. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, BB gun. Is that all I've got? You're joking. Laser pistol. I hate laser pistols. Right. Well, at least he's dead. I mean, I'd have happily had a chat with him, but, you know, you could see he was... Oh my god, my head's crying out for attention. Alright, what are you crying for? You're not so bad now. Yeah, I'd happily sat down and a chat with him, but um, as you can see, he wasn't very up for that. Let's wait for my head to clear. There we go. Right, oh, there are mines here as well. How sneaky. I can't be arsed. The panic that is trying to disarm them. Alright, maybe just one. Because I'm feeling like a bit of a thrill seeker. Wait. You watch me cock this up now. Nearly cocked up. Oh, man. It's just dangerous. Well, this guy's obviously been getting fairly comfortable here. Caution. Who's here? Hmm. Probably because there's mines around, actually. I'll take that steak. Medical brace. Oh, do you know what? It's because I was crouching down. Right, where are you? Oh, you must be up there. If he planted all those, nice. I will take that. Richfield. Thank you kindly. Oh yeah, I've really got to put some more points into my lockpicking skill because it's obviously a handy thing to have. Nice. Speaking of which... I don't really bother about science too much. Medicine good though because you get more 
hit points, don't you? Yeah. Let's go for that. Well, that's that sorted. Let's see. I think it's time to head back to Megaton briefly. Give Moira her presence, hot potato. And see what she's got on offer for us next. I'm keen to press on with the story, really. But, like I've said before, these little jobs, they're just... I don't know, there's just something cool about... Doing the little side quest. But I do want to press on a bit, though. Because I've levelled up a little bit, so... Feeling better about heading towards the city. Because I seem to remember some. How are nasty those things. hot little potatoes? Or whatever. You know what I mean. Yeah. My very own landmine. Oh, it's like a, just what, what I've always wanted. It's like I was just giving her a well, guinea pig. Always since I sent you out on this, anyway. Now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? Horrible. What's it like disarming a landmine? Horrible. Do you think I'm an idiot? I may be a little impulsive, but not an idiot. I'll just take a look at this on my own then. I know you may not want to see any more explosives for a while, but obviously you know your way around them. I have a couple rainy day toys of mine. And looking at this landmine, it gives me an idea. It's a terrible device that does terrible things, of course. But it's easy to make your own, too. It definitely is. Okay. I'm trying to put that same great sense of humor you've got into the book. Keep it up, and it'll inform and entertain. Here, for your services, I've saved up quite a few stim packs. Just what I always wanted, actually. Let's see what she's got for the us. The second chapter don't is going to be a bit trickier, it. I think. It'll cover how to handle creatures out there, for better or worse. For example, repelling mole rats, uh, learning about mire lurks, and when all else fails, how to handle being injured. So let's buckle down and get to work on this chapter. What's first? Right, I will leave it alone for a while. Well, I guess I can wait a little. I've got plenty of other projects to work on after all. We come back soon and and we will come back to these in a little bit let's see what, what you got for need? sale right got some bb guns You know what? I've been wearing like a worse suit than one I've had in my possession this whole time. What a dope. I'll change it. Pay a bit of cigarettes. Ammo. That's what we're after. Good hunting. Have you thought about disarming the bomb? Oh, I couldn't do that. It'd be a real blow to those nice folks in the church. Besides, it's not like that bomb ever hurt anyone. Interesting way of looking at it. Come back soon. Except that it's like, you know, potentially going to go off at any time. Oh, well. Right, we're going to head towards this. 
but perhaps uh, it's good to rest somewhere first. Oh no, we'll we'll rest on the way. So I think that, well, if I remember rightly, we're heading towards the city, towards the Galaxy Radio, where my dad was supposed to be going. That's the guy who ran away. Where are Welcome you going now? What? Is there a rally on or something? Who are you? Can you help me? I need water. Purified water. Please. Well, perhaps if you didn't run away. Please, if you find some, please. Can't help you. Now, where exactly am I going? Right. Okay, let's go. Do love these good long treks across the wasteland because you never know what you might find like that place i found in minefield i don't actually remember going in there the first time i played this so it might be that i've just completely overlooked something there and you know that's something to discover this time Yeah, we'll get rid of the old energy gun ammo first and save the best for last. Right, I'm going to stop here and wait a little while. Because I hate trekking around in the dark. It's a boring ass time for this guy, he's just stood there. Just like waiting for the sun to rise. I haven't even changed that armor yet. for a smooth walk. Oh, I think it's our favourite supermarket. Yep. Fond memories. Right, okay. Go across the river. Preferably without being poisoned by radiation. It's always cool to look under the bridges as well because I often I'll find stuff like this, like oh it's a mine. You dick. Someone booby trapped the bed. But it's stuff like this. I just stay and sleep a little bit. Get some health back, hopefully. Just walked straight into that trap, didn't I? I don't know why I took the lunchbox, because there's nothing in there, is there?
So yeah, it's always kind of good to check because you never know what you might turn up. I don't remember. Oh. oh my god, that face is terrifying. Where did the other one go that I fake prized? Oh, right there. Reminds me of, uh, say, the first episode of Red Dwarf. When Dave List is just eating piles of stuff, I guess because he's just hungry. Turns out it's his crewmates. Everyone's dead, Dave. Everybody's dead. Watch it, give Peterson. Everybody's dead, Dave. Something to that effect. What am I doing? Right, I think it's telling me that uh, it's easier to take this metro station to there and then come out at the Radio Plaza building thing. But maybe I can just walk through the city. I'm going to save because it's wise. Mad robot. Has he got a head made of, what, adamantium or something? Seriously. Do you know what? Sod this.
Where's my grenades? Not enough AP. What? Come on. What? Oh dear. Maybe there's a good reason why I should have taken the Metro. Namely that guy. Hmm. I'm gonna go. Take the Metro. Not because I have to, just because I like trains. And it seems to be the wise option. Okay. Ventured into the city there. I think I bit off maybe a little bit more than I can chew at this level. So I'm gonna follow the Pip Boy's advice and head for the metro station. Yes. Which should take me to the GNR building. Well, that'll about do it for this time. So. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed that. Um, join us next time. I'm going to be going to the GNR building and following in my father's footsteps. So, if you want to help us out, do give us a like, subscribe to the channel, and take it easy. See you next time. Ta-da.